Hello again everyone, this is Tim Buell for GottaBeMobile.com and I'm back today with another Mac video tutorial. Today's topic is, how do I prepare my Mac for sale? What do I need to do before I get this thing packaged up, sent off to potentially a stranger or a friend or family member and make sure it's clean, ready for them to use? There's a couple of steps we should definitely take to preserve your identity and the first of which is removing any iCloud information from the computer iCloud is usually syncing contacts, calendars, notes, Safari, often passwords, credit card information now. It's a good idea to get signed out and make sure everything is deleted from the computer. You also want to make sure that you remove the unit from the Find My iPhone feature. Now, Find My iPhone recently started including Macs in there, and you want to go to iCloud.com and make sure it's removed from the account if signing out didn't already do it for you. It may go without saying, but it's always a great idea to ensure you have a data backup. If you're not using Time Machine with an external hard drive, make sure you manually are going through and backing up information you cannot afford to lose because the next step we're going to take is erasing and restoring the hard drive in order to get the computer fresh and ready for setup. Once you're finished backing up and you're satisfied that everything has been saved, it's usually a good idea to check that the hard drive indeed did save everything by plugging it into another computer and double checking all the information's there. You're also going to want to deauthorize the iTunes accounts for everyone who's logged in on the computer. This way, if you get a new machine, it's not going to have a computer that's no longer in your possession marked on your authorization list. Once you're ready there, restart the computer and we're going to get this computer wiped and ready for the new user to use it again. By holding Command and R upon startup, you launch the recovery hard drive on the computer. If you've used recovery before to troubleshoot or fix any problems with the computer, you're probably familiar with some of the tools, but the one we need is Disk Utility. Opening Disk Utility will reveal your hard drive in the window on the left hand side, and from there you can perform an erase. Erasing the hard drive is going to erase the data on it. Just to clarify, you need to have everything backed up at this point because without data recovery software, it might be expensive to try to get some of this information back if you deleted it. Once that hard drive has been erased, we want to reinstall the operating system. So whatever version you currently are running on there is perfectly fine to use to restart the computer to its fresh out of the box state. As always, give it a good spit shine and make sure it's physically presentable before you sell it online or to a friend. And from there, you should be good to go with a brand new MacBook or iMac, whatever you're selling. Hope you guys found this helpful, and we'll talk to you soon.